Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Capricorn. All right. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Capricorn, what we have shown up is in the Angel Answers deck is unlikely. Okay, so something is unlikely to unfold how you're thinking, what you, how you think it should unfold, how you envisioned it. It just, it doesn't mean that um, things are going to go sour, south, bad. It's not going to happen. It's just unlikely that maybe the turn of events that you're thinking is, it's just not going to go that way, but. Keep in mind, um, or think positive, or, or think about the positive alternative. Just because it doesn't go like this, doesn't mean it doesn't happen at all. This could be in terms of um, wedding plans or plans, something you're planning. Just because it didn't go exactly how you're planning, doesn't mean you're not going to have a good time. It's not going to be phenomenal. It's not going to be spectacular. Um, just because the relationship didn't get off to this quote-unquote right start. I don't know what that means. Everybody, it means something different for everybody. Uh, it doesn't mean that the relationship is doomed. More Some relationships take more work than others. Capricorn, how you're showing up to the reading is dark male. So this dark male may be significant to the reading. You could be the dark male. Um, you could get a lot of attention. Um, you could have a... Um, curly hair or you can have a wavy hair um, you get that, that sexy Rico Suave type vibe off um, you could be different ethnicity than your person because we've got the blonde female coming up um, this could be someone with reddish brown hair blonde hair um, this is someone who's youthful younger this person is significant to the relationship also there could be an age gap here also so um, this is how you're showing up to where it's almost like two individuals kind of trying to come together how trying to figure out how to merge their lives together how to share their lives with one another um, one person has more experience than the other somebody is I guess um, has lesser experience life experience work experience money I don't know Your person is coming to the connection as travel and a soulmate. So they feel like you're their soulmate, whomever you're thinking of. I feel like there's three energies here where Capricorn is with a, a particular person, but then there's someone on the outside. I don't think there's much communication or the communication is in regards to the children or obligation between the two of you. It's not in regards to maybe a, a love affair or, or love or anything of that nature. Some of you have plans of getting back with the mother or the father of your children, but then there was cancel cancellation, like something got canceled out, something, um, it's, it's not a go. It's not moving forward. Somebody is stuck or someone is stuck. Someone also, their travel plans or the plans that they made are now at a halt, at a stop, standstill. Okay. Um, right. Even though this person is your soulmate. We have several different soulmates in this lifetime. Um, it could have been that you guys met. You resonate on a soul level. It was supposed to be a short-lived connection or maybe a long one. I don't know. But um, the story is unfolding in the most unlikely way possible. Uh, but keep, but stay positive. Keep a positive outlook about the alternative. Some of this definitely speaks of plans, travel plans, wedding plans, plans, plans not going in the fashion that 
someone thought they would go. They had it all mapped out and now it's reversing. This could also be in business too. Someone could be using their significant other to, you know, prompt their business up or push the business. Um, and it's not using in a bad way, but it's more so, you know, maybe your significant other or the person that you are in relationship with is the brand uh, of your business or they help a lot in terms of your business. Um, someone could be the manager of the other person. So, you know, my husband is my manager. My boyfriend is my manager. My wife is my manager. Something of that nature. Some some plans in, involving that are not going as smoothly or not how it all is mapped out to go. Capricorn, you're coming to the reading is um, saying that you have you're having financial issues. You can't focus on love, okay? And you may be taking a break from um, those in your community, friends, family, uh, people you travel with, hang out with, play with. You may be taking a break because you're trying to restore or save up for or to regain or recover from maybe a financial loss. You also don't have enough money to help the people in your community, which would be friends or family, or you can't afford the help anymore, is what I'm hearing. Um, some of you can't afford daycare. Or someone you're dealing with can't afford daycare. They can't afford to travel right now or travel to you. Your person is coming up is um, in the spotlight, getting some reward, accolade, high honor here, um, recognition, winning an award, uh, being recognized for uh, the, their contribution to um, passing an exam, getting their diploma, uh, something of that nature. There could be visitors in your home because um, someone is... Um, Excelling, getting married, uh, graduating, something of that nature. We got addicted coming out to your person, coming out for your person. Some of you need space, you need time, you don't want to be involved, you don't want the personal, the interpersonal connection right now because you need to focus on your finances. But this person is addicted to you and they feel like you are their soulmate okay um or vice versa this is how you're coming up someone is giving you a firm no okay um no to not getting back together no to not coming to see you no to not to not traveling to you no to giving you money loaning you money i don't know Someone is in deep concern, maybe even a bit of depression or a depressive state in terms of another person, in terms of the things not working out of the way that they plan. Something is concerning them. Somebody is spending a lot of money on a woman, okay? And it could be that at this point they don't have all of this money that they're spending or they don't have it to spend, okay? Someone could be neglecting their children. Right. The children could be long distance uh, away from them. The children could be the only thing holding you and another person together. Someone is saying, if you call or text, I will answer. Uh, there is an energy of somebody wanting a rich husband. Yeah, and, and maybe this husband is tired of being a husband, tired of spending of dishing out, putting out for the wife. Once again, an energy of not having the money right now. But they want you to know that they they, they think you're beautiful. Okay? Um, this also could be that third party or that third energy on the outskirts. Maybe they don't have the time, the energy, the money to come to you. They have to spend all of their resources at, you know, in home, at home, um, where they're obligated. They're tired of doing this. They would like to be somewhere else with someone else. They would like to travel to this person. But yet yeah, something got canceled here. Some intimate relationship. Can, uh, yeah, 
some intimate relationship. Money is coming in, but it's going out just as fast as it comes in. And someone has to do a lot of work to bring it in. And it's Yeah, somebody has to do a lot of work to bring the money in here. It's taking another person to an energy of is it is it really worth it? I'm doing this back breaking work or I'm doing this these long hours or I'm you know hustling and bustling. What am I getting in return is what someone is asking also. Someone is concerned about the equality or the lack thereof. Um, in a connection, they're concerned about the balance. It might be off. Someone is overspending, overgiving, overdoing. And, and that is the addiction. Someone is addicted to the other person or addicted, addicted to making the other person happy, even at their own expense. This is what I have for you, Capricorn. If it resonates for you, go over to the website. Book your own oracle reading, just like this one at the website. It will be linked below. Uh, or get any reading at the website level. If you have a question or two, you could text it to the number below. Also, um, you could donate to the channel. If you feel like you took anything from the reading, you could give back by buying me a coffee. The link is below. It says, buy me a coffee. Thank you, Capricorn. Many blessings to you. Take care.